How you doing? How you been? What's going on? What's good? How you getting in? Everybody getting a fuzzy. What's going on, people? What's going on, people? Um, I come to you with another story as far as again today. Now, this story went out as far as October the 17th, which was yesterday, because today is the 18th. And this story is about Lily Mac Magadan, 18 years old. Here, here she is right here. Now, her story is, now she's from um, St. Stock Catholic School. And that's in Maidstone, Kent. And of course, this is in England. Now, this is her story. Check this out. Transgender schoolgirl sent home for wearing the wrong clothes when legal battles after outpouring of support from pupils. Lily Magadan, 18 years old, is transgender and she was dressing as a boy but then she started putting up stuff as reference to a girl. Lily launched a legal battle after being sent home for wearing girls' clothes. The sixth Former was threatened with suspension after arriving in girls' clothes at St. Simon Stock Catholic School in Midstone, Kent, in March. Lily, who posted before and after pictures online of her in boys and girl clothes, said, It was a big step for me. It made me feel so happy until I was sent home. School chiefs apologized to Lily Bourne, um, Mel for suspension. She added, I didn't think that it would be a problem. I assumed that the school would know their obligations. She hired a solicitor who reminded the school a person must be a person must not be discriminated against because of gender reassignment as a transsexual. Lily from Chatham was also backed by 200 people who signed a petition supporting her. The school now apologizes and changes its rules while teachers are to get transgender training. After a lengthy battle, the school has changed its rules. Lily says, I feel triumph. When I'm contacting solicitors, I'm reaffirmed I was right. I was so happy about the changes, but I felt it was something I shouldn't have had to fight for at all. She was also back with 200 people who signed a petition supporting her. A school spokesman said, we value highly the views of all our students and take all points of view into act count as we develop. How can you see that? She sued the school and she won because she wants to, you know, dress like a girl. She felt as though it shouldn't have been a problem as far as, you know, her doing it and stuff. You know, so God bless you. 18 years old. Because the girls are coming out. <laughs> You know, and it's amazing, you know, as, as far as the world in some parts of being acceptable and, you know, it's a good time to you can hear something as far as, you know, people are trying to work with you as far as gender reassignment, as far as accepting transgenders and stuff and, you know, trying to accommodate people as far as living and stuff and, you know, maybe they have some people that have a good heart is, you know, don't want these trans kids as far as this woman because she's only 18 years old. She's trans teen and commit suicide and stuff. You know, and it kind of give you a better message as far as the younger ones is looking on. I really think a lot of times people forget that the young people will actually be watching as well. You know, we do these um, videos of reference. Well, I do these videos of to a lot of teen, not teen, not teens, but adult trans women being murdered as far as well as trans men. You know, and the sad part about it is we forget that the younger ones are actually looking on and they're watching all this stuff happen and they're learning and stuff. 
you know, so as far as this match, as far as Lily, you know, she's sitting out there and everything, and, you know, um, she's really pretty and stuff, she's got a cute little outfits and stuff. You know, and she says her truth, and, you know, she's living her truth and stuff like that, so God bless you, Lily, and, you know, keep pushing down doors and stuff like that, because you are leading within your own right, and I'm sure your story will help someone somewhere. You know, within the world we live in, as far as maybe understanding. Anyway, the being said, I just want to share that with you. And I want to say that I love you. And I want to thank you for watching Kirsten Reading.